What's up guys, David here, and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to SIM unlock the iPhone 7. It's worth noting that this method also works for the iPhone 7 Plus and pretty much any other iPhone out there. Now, right up front, I do want to let you know that this method isn't free. It does cost some money, but the money you can potentially save on roaming charges and the resale value it adds back to your phone could make it well worth the cost. So the first thing you're going to want to do is turn off Find My iPhone, which you can do by going into the settings, then iPhone iCloud, then find my iPhone, and then flip the switch to the off position. Once you've done that, go back to the home screen and open up the dialer, and dial star pound zero six pound to bring up your iPhone's IMEI number. Write this number down and make sure that you get it right as you're going to need it later. The next step is to get the unique unlock code that your phone needs from an unlocking service. Our sponsors and trusted source is Unlock River, so we'll be using them here, where all you have to do is enter in your information. So in my case, the carrier is AT&T United States, but make sure to select whichever carrier your iPhone is actually locked to. So manufacturer is obviously Apple, we're unlocking the iPhone 7, and then we're going to enter in that IMEI number that we got earlier, making sure to double check that it's entered correctly. Finally, put in your valid email address as this is where your unlock confirmation will be sent. So as you can see here, the unlock could take a while to process. For me, it was just a few hours, but in some cases, it can take up to a few business days. After that, just hit unlock to complete your purchase, and soon enough, you'll get an email that looks something like this, telling you that your iPhone 7 has been unlocked. And from here, all you have to do is enter in an unaccepted SIM card. So basically, any SIM card that isn't from the carrier your phone is locked to. So in my case, since the phone is locked to AT&T, I'll enter in a T-Mobile SIM card, and then all you have to do is connect the phone to Wi-Fi. And that's it, your iPhone will be officially unlocked. If you don't have Wi-Fi available, you can always just connect your phone to iTunes and that'll do the trick as well. But anyways, that is it for me in this video. Thank you guys for watching and as always, I'll see you in the very next episode.